Another thing that comes up is, you know, sex drive. And as you know, as men get older, the level of testosterone continues to drift down. Right. So age is part of the reason why the libido can go down. But also a lot of people don't know that if they are under anxiety, they're under stress, right. low thyroid can actually lower your libido. Or if you're on medical, uh, many medications, especially high blood pressure medications or anti-anxiety or depression, um, they may actually lose their libido, but we can check your testosterone. Mm -hmm. I always you know, I tell them to get your testosterone level before nine o'clock because it can be lower at the end of the day. And depending on what goes on and what medical issues you have, we may supplement some of those testosterone right. and really give you the energy and the, the, you know, you're not gonna be fatigued, you can hit the gym and you really feel good. Now, I'm not advocating that men should go out and get testosterone because there are a lot right. of side effects, right. but that's a discussion you wanna have with your doctor. Right, and, and for women as well. I mean, our libidos can be affected as well through age. Interestingly enough, our testosterone levels actually start to increase relative to our estrogen levels, which, which actually decrease. That's not good for uh, men out there, that's right. No, we become much more assertive and aggressive. It's wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> But, um, You're funny. but certainly they, um, but women's libido certainly can be affected um, as, as well. And there are medical treatments to, to help improve that if, it, if it's a medical issue. Um, so, and, and that's a, always a difficult discussion to have with your physician, especially your primary care physician. You may not feel as comfortable, um, but, you, but you should. They're open to that discussion.